Hello everyone and welcome, welcome, welcome to my channel. This is 69 in Sync. Guys, thank you so much for joining me here in this journey. Uh, we are growing tremendously. I appreciate you guys so much for all of your love, your support, your comments, and your subscriptions, truly. You guys, I have a sort of message to give you all. Like, do I? Um, I'm going to go ahead and shuffle just because I didn't pre-shuffle. We're going to do that together. But you guys, please like, comment, and subscribe. If you are new here, welcome. And thank you so much for joining the family. Oh, my gosh. Cards are scattered. That was on me, y'all. I can't put that on nothing else. It was me. It was me. It was me. I also can't deny that a lot of these cards, you know, these cards, they speak up. A lot of these cards came out earlier. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. But we got a big message today. We got a big message coming in intuitively. Um, I didn't get this message when I first woke up because I didn't write down my dream, okay? My dream was vivid and I didn't write it down. But, y'all, I'm telling you. It's a lot of energy going on right now. I see a star at the bottom of the deck. This is the reason why, probably, because you are a star. But uh, that's what Spirit's telling me. You guys are a star. Could be in a public eye. But here are a few of my messages. You know, guys, I write it down, so here it is. Um, it's some masculine energy um, is what I saw in my dream. But it was him or, you know, it could switch the roles, okay? It could be masculine energy or feminine energy wants attention over a child or childlike energy uh also um they could either want to be a step parent too this could uh this could involve an interracial couple okay trying to figure out how to uh co-parent is what i'm getting as well uh what i those are the messages i got from my dream last night but it says um new house move be cautious of your neighbors, okay? It could be a lot of temptation in the new area that you might move to, okay? So just be uh, careful of like thieves and stealer, people that steal, okay? Um, temptation's really big, you guys. I wanna definitely pinpoint on temptation. You guys could have a lot of an urge, okay? Be very tempted to react or respond, okay? Spirit wanted me to sit down and do this message uh, and, and told me to do this message earlier. But I was going to skip over it until now, okay? Spirit saying that you guys are being tested right now. So, please be cautious if you guys are about... In any moves that you're about to make. Let me go ahead and read my affirmation for you guys. If you guys missed it earlier, it says, I am powerful from the words I speak to the thoughts I think and the actions I take, Okay? So truly, that was my affirmation that I wrote out today, you guys. And I think it's because, you know, on a subconscious level, I, I felt the energy and everything like that. But it, it, it started revealing all why I needed that message um, as the day continued from morning now until three o'clock in the afternoon. But you guys, codependency, all right? You guys could be tempted even... I'm going to go back to tempted because I'm going to keep saying tempted because I feel like a lot of you guys could be tempted to go back to old situations, old people um, that didn't really support you or, you know, give your life a boost, if you get what I'm saying. You know, uh, these people could have been very codependent towards you and your energy and things like that. I got the five here. I'm going to release this uh, read at 555, five, five, but five meaning transformation. Okay, you guys switched it up. You changed. This is a lot of post-retrograde energy. A lot of you guys could be feeling like you're in a retrograde still. Like, isn't it supposed to be over? No, still got a little retrograde dust on it. We are going to continue forward, though, you all. And um, those are my intuitive messages that I have for you guys. I hope that you guys can take that into um, consideration. You know what I'm saying? Like, seriously, get yourself some lavender. I'm feeling like a lot of anxious energy. Get yourself some lavender and smell it. Put it in the air. Put it in the aroma. Put it in your tea. Put it in your in your bath waters, okay? When you're doing your spiritual baths. You know, things like that. Pray. 
all right um definitely get into your bibles read uh spirit's trying to tell you guys something but it's about your temptation it's about you being tempted or somebody or people in spirits being tempted around you um i'm gonna give you guys an example of uh me being tempted today actually by you know, wanting to respond I, I was communicating fairly well today um more so than often but i got a call from my sister and this is how i knew it was the spirit not the person right you can't always just say oh i'm so upset with that person because remember that spirits are sent to you as well energies are sent to you through the people that you love and you care about. So I believe that this was a spirit that was sent through my sister, but she, where she's usually supportive, you know, it was like, she seen I posted something on social media and she called me and I don't know if she was calling to hate on me or <laughs> what it was, but as soon as she got on the phone, she said, wow, you're a crazy lady. Guys, I cannot tell you how that hurt, you know? But it did, and it was just like, it was also an awakening, you know, once I was able to really sit with the emotions and kind of see where it was coming from, look throughout my day and see, you know, what type of energy have I been in or, you know, have experienced already. Really what I heard in that message was exactly what I'm saying. I think that she was hating, but it was a spirit, you know. It's because spirit wants us to know that we are going to hire, hire, places okay we are on a journey of so many adventures i mean so much is ahead of us i mean i'm trying to find the words to say it, but you guys if you, if you understand what i'm saying or can really kind of comprehend a little bit spirit has us on a big glow up you get what i'm saying it's a big glow up now everybody's gonna see it but you're gonna find out very fast that a lot of people that you know you support you care for do not support that and guys that is absolutely okay all right um i feel i have to send that message out because somebody needs to hear that um just because you are being doubted today um you you guys may have worked up well, well excuse me communications could be off some people may just be coming to you and not knowing how to really communicate how they feel some people are shocked by what you're doing it's amazing to them they are astounded they are shocked their mouth they their mouth is like wide open falling to the ground their jaws are dropping they don't really know how to express your glow up and how you're moving so fast they can't explain it and even i'm hearing conversations with other people about you are in rooms that you never thought you could walk in and also in rooms that you knew the haters was hating on you but you're the best topic of conversation so i mean why not talk about you all right because there's so much that god has for you guys okay there's so much that spirit wants to guide you to and um you have to be willing to allow it in but understand that it comes with all of the temptation it comes with all of the what looks like hate you know, what looks like confusion, what looks like, you know, madness. The Spirit is telling you right now that, guys, don't be tempted to just do anything. Examine. Look at, you are headed somewhere on a whole nother journey. Don't let nothing mess this up for you. Let nothing destroy this for you, okay? Like, seriously, you guys, I feel this so heavy. And um, I had to sit back in my chair. I was like, no, I'm going to go and get something to eat. I was going to go get some pie pies and stuff, you know. <laughs> I still am going to do that. But the spirit guided me back to my altar and say, do this reading. If somebody needs to hear it, then I'm going to go ahead and do it. But you guys, that is what I have for the intuitive message. I'm going to go ahead and cut this video. And then we're going to go into the collective energy for the day, all right? And we're going to see what spirit has to say and what spirit... Um, you know, wants to get through to you all. All right. But with that being said, you guys, I hope this was helpful for somebody. Peace.